Left, wing late. Night CBS host Stephen Colbert honored the legacy of Rev. Dr. Martin Luther King in his opening monologue on Monday by quoting First Lady Melania Trump's tweet about the civil rights leader, cruelly mimicking her Slovenian accent and claiming that she really wants to be free at last. Let's start off the evening on a positive note. Happy Martin Luther King Jr. Day. A beautiful day to celebrate. A beautiful message to remember. Colbert said before targeting Mrs. Trump. Both the president and the first lady noted the day on Twitter. Melania's tweet was short and sweet. Riffing on a famous line from Dr. King's I have a dream speech, Colbert said she really relates to Dr. King's message, especially the part about wanting to be free at last. It's what I heard. It's what I heard. Colbert continued to twist the knife. The oddest thing about that tweet was the graphic she used, which just said MLK Day. Timely, dot and factual. Stephen Colbert continued. And I'm being told we have a preview of the First Lady's tweet for tomorrow. Together we honor, Tuesday, January 21st. Again, so truthful. Colbert's bigoted Melania Trump barbs, bigoted because he never came close to throwing the same invective at Michelle Obama, came on the eve of President Donald Trump's Senate impeachment trial. So you know Colbert couldn't resist. The president's lawyers say that abuse of power is not impeachable. Yes it is. It's the most powerful job in the world. That's why abuse of power is the thing a president is not supposed to do. Stephen Colbert claimed, later saying that the Republican senators supporting Trump are nothing more than vengeful zombies.